guys, you've seen our Bakora update deck profile. If you haven't, check the annotations. Look at that, it's really cool. We're doing a duel with his updated deck now versus good old fashioned Yugi's Valsity deck. Yep, I'm a Delta, gonna be playing Bakora's deck because he's one of my favorite characters, maybe you may know. And then Blue's over here with Yugi's Valsity deck, which is uh, the first time we've used our, I'll be going first, the first time we've used Yugi's Valsity deck in a, in a little bit, I think, so it's a nice little throwback. Who picked up six cards right off the top. Guys, hopefully we'll see a Dark Sanctuary. Here's hoping. Uh, let's set one to each zone and end my turn. So we figured that the Navy duel would be against Yugi because it was a very, you know, important duel. It was This is Bakora's big duel. Showed his was, deck off. Yeah, and the key card was Dark Sanctuary, which is the new card that's been added finally. I mean it's first duels versus bones. It's uh, it was over fast. That was really just to give us a flavor of what Bakora was. But yeah, uh, it, not really significant. We're not going to do a bonus or a spin or do that, it. It explained how we got into the Battle State Tournament, and then also yeah, that's true. wanted to remind us how evil crazy that Yami Bakura is. It's like, okay, yeah, yeah. Um, So I'm going to set a monster and set two cards face down. Sure. And. End? And draw. See, I gotta be afraid because uh, Yugi's deck is full of traps. Uh, I'll just set one monster and end. You know, I could uh, make a cool play with like Dark Ruler Hades or something and just run to a friggin' Mirror Force. Alright, well... Are we gonna see a tribute come on? Uh-oh! Summon Skull! No, I'm gonna flip up Queen's Light and attack that set monster. This one? Yeah, I hope it's not... Gurnia! Hope is not Earthbound Spirit. I figured you must have something that's actually not Earthbound Spirit. Yeah, or Ghost Ghost of Flight Dreams. Or him. Porch's Secret would tie Headless Knight would beat it too. But Core's monsters have strong defense. Yeah. Is it my turn? Sure, man. Draw. I tribute my face down monster, the Headless Knight. There it is. To summon the Earl of Demise. Uh, like like for my uh, Bakura voice, Earl of Demise, attack his Queen's Knight. Which got a little weird there. Um, Mirror Force. Regulation oh, tribe. All right, good card to have. So I'll declare a feed. Yeah, yeah. Just, you know. You know, actually, against Bakura, most time you just use that for one turn, but it, it might be worth keeping it up against Bakura's deck because his deck is very homogenous. And he destroyed um, one yeah. of my only zombies. So, yeah. I end my turn. I right, look at this, guys. Bakora and the Pharaoh throwing down pretty hard, pretty fast. I'm just hoping to get to that Dark Sanctuary, which I'm sure will be met with, like, the spell or something. I had decided not to pay the cost of this card. Probably not a bad idea. And switch my Queen's Light to defense mode? Sure. I'll end my turn. Draw. Hmm. What's life without a little risk? I tribute the Earl of Demise for Puppet Master. By paying 2,000 life points, I special summon Headless Knight and the Earl of Demise back to the field. There we go. Oh, baby, Torrential Tribute coming on. I'm just kidding. That would be that would be horrible for me, though. Why would I have to be Chain Destruction? Sure. Um, it has to be 2,000 or less. Yeah. So headless knight, headless knight. Sure. Wow, getting some uh, value out of that card. I mean, uh, helping my dark necro fear. Yeah, I mean, with this deck, it's just a matter of picking what card. But all right, well, they can't attack this turn, so I will end my turn. Oh, nothing can attack this turn. I mean, it can, but it has zero attack. True. So not much point there. Well, guys, I put three monsters on the field. If only I had my own Egyptian God card. Right. If only the core played that game. All right, I'm not Danny Green. I'm not going to pretend to be good at this, but just for the funny. Drop a comment if you know a voice actor for Bakora, because I don't. I think he's going to piss someone off. All right, now it's my turn. And I have just the card to stop you, Bakura. Right, Fate. Exile of the Oh, jeez. Destroy all face-up fiend-type monsters on the field. Wow. I A 50-card deck. 
I, I know Exile of the Wicked's in there, but it's like, what are the odds? I guess the odds were pretty good in your case. Now, Queen's Knight. Joe attack his life points directly with insert made up attack name that sounds Dang. cool. I'm at almost half life. One more card, and I'll end my turn. Half life three confirmed. Draw. <laughs> you paid yourself that. I was like, oh, good. <laughs> yeah, that was good for you. So he's up to me. I've drawn just the card I need. Mother. I activate Dark Sanctuary. Row. <laughs> now you're in for it. All right, guys, just because this is a new card, I'll read what it does. We don't errata it like it's, we do many of our cards. It, we felt it was fine. It's Konami did a good job. If a spirit message card would be placed on your field with Destiny Board, you can special it as a normal monster, fiend type, dark, level 1, attack 0, defense 0 instead, and if you do, it is unaffected by card effects except Destiny Board and cannot be targeted for attacks, but yes, it does strange. not prevent your opponent from attacking you directly. When an opponent's monster declares an attack, toss a coin, and if the result is heads, negate the attack, and if you do, inflict damage your opponent equal to half the current attack of that monster your opponent controls. Yet yeah, strangely, um, the spirit message monster thing can be tributed. Yeah, but we are not really going to play it like that. No, or just fun fact. Then, I banish three of my fiends to summon Dark Necrophia. So again, quickly, in the anime, you can activate Dark Sanctuary once a Dark Necrophia was destroyed. Uh, yeah, Konami didn't put that in there, which is fine. The card works. It has, it the, works it has well. the key effects, which are the spirit messages, and the, uh, what was called Ghost of Dark Sanctuary, which is just the, uh, the battle damage... Point flip effect. Look at this, guys. Huge play Puppet Master met with an exile of the Wicked that destroyed three monsters and followed up by just about the best turn I could possibly hope for. Attack Queen's Knight. I activate my face stone card. Your force. Magic Cylinder. Oh, wow, my life points are really not going up anytime soon. Well, it's better than a mirror force, I, I guess. I'll end my turn. Hunt of the cards. Please don't guide him. I just, I've been taking a lot of damage really fast. I'll place one card face down. Oh, he drew Death Tornado. God damn it. And then my turn. Or Mirror Force. But if you Mirror Force, at least I get to take control of your monster. Dark Necker for your attack. Sweet, getting in that 700. I'll do it for you. Just because I'm so excited to finally do some damage to you. Big difference in life points, but one of us is winning the field. Only 5,000 difference. I'll set one monster and end my turn. It is only a 5,000 difference. I can make that up in a couple Dark Necrophy attacks. Or one Dark Sanctuary effect. This is this is a really, really good board, though, for Bakora. Like, Dark Sanctuary really, really stops your opponent from attacking. Sort I like, end my turn. Sort of like Fairy Box, but not as good. Draw. I tribute Goblin Zombie. To summon Dark Ruler Hades. Yeah, as if things weren't bad enough for you already. Let's have Dark Necrophia attack. Go! Mirror Force. Oh my God. Oh, guys, I'm dying. I'm 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 actually dying right now. You should know, Bakura. You cannot stop the King of Games. All right. Well. Main phase two, Monster Reborn. I can't revive the Dez, but I can bring back the Earl of Demise. Just because, I, I don't know, I'm afraid of like you Monster Borning something and going for game. I should have checked your graveyard too. <laughs> yes. Queen's the only thing. I thought Queen's Eye was the only thing. You can put me your force. Yeah. I, uh, I'll set that and end my turn. Hit me with your best shot. I've still got Dark Sanctuary on the field at least. Until he, like, me to spells or dust and airs that. I'll end my turn. Draw. By the way, guys, like us on Facebook. Shameless plug. Click the ads if you really love us. So we use the get cards like Dark Sanctuary right when they come out. Hey, our Facebook's got a um, little over 400 likes. If that hits 500, I'm... Probably a giveaway. Maybe. Probably. I, can, I think I can see one of those coming on. I am going to... Hmm... I'm gonna I'm gonna be cautious. I'll have Earl Demise attack. Go face down. Jeez. Press this button on dual disc. Beeping sound. Car flips up. Spell. Spellbinding circle. 
Alright, I'll set one monster and end my turn. Wow, you've you've been making it really hard to get through. But at least you don't seem to have an answer, Dark Sanctuary, for now. I'm just waiting for you to draw Mirror Force. I mean, <sighs> D-Spell or Dust Tornado. I end my turn. Draw. I will set one card and end my turn. Let's go. Let's go. I'll end my turn. Before you end, I activate Destiny Board. Oh my god. Alright, that were, no, good good play. You were in the middle of a dramatic something or other. I was hoping to do a Destiny Board Dark Sanctuary <laughs> combo, but but Blue ruined it for you guys. Let Blue know he's a loser in the comments. I know, Blue's a loser. I draw. I'm sorry. Yuki is shutting down Makura today. I activate Premature Burial by paying 800 life points. Premature Burial will let me special summon Dark Necrofear. Dark Necrofear, attack him directly. Yeah, I can't stop this. Oh, thank goodness, guys. Look at this. I had to do a Puppet Master play. Dark Necrofear, Dark Ruler Hades, Earl of Demise twice, just for Dark Necrofear to finally be punching some damage in. And because I know you don't ride Geki, I'll set one monster and then my turn. I'm getting life points close, guys. I'll just play one card face down and end my turn. You might be in for a rough day. That is not a card I want to play right now. Dark Necrofear, attack him directly. Dust Tornado! Oh my god. On Premature Burial? Yeah, I'm pretty much sure okay. I don't know, maybe you're gonna go for Dark Sanctuary. No, it would have been a fair play. Fair play. And you don't have a monster for me to take either. Right. Yeah, that's the second time, if you notice, I destroyed Dark Necrofear. I have no monsters. Now you that's, only have D spell left, so you can't just tornado a second Destiny board. So that's good for me. I'll end my turn. Man, this is this is a back and forth game. I keep dropping these big threats, and you keep having answers. Even even non-conventional answers. Like just any other premature burial. Alright. I'll set one card face down. I take Monster Reborn. Oh, jeez. On Queen's Knight. And tributing her. For Summon Skull. Do you dare attack? Hmm. Maybe not at the moment. I'll end. I draw with something your Dark Necrofear cannot wipe off the board. Hmm. Let's activate Dark Designator. Declare one monster card name. If the declared cards in your opponent's deck, add one of that card to your opponent's hand. And this card is really great. I mean, it's great in a lot of places, like especially competitive, because you kind of know what's in your opponent's deck. If you know what the deck is, but it's great in competitive too, because we, we know all the decks. And... Now, if I were like Bakura, I would make you add your Egyptian God card, but considering I only have a couple cards in my hand, that's not that hot of a play. Give me that Buster Blader. Well, right. it goes to your hand. I think we can all assume what my next card's gonna be. Exchange? I wanna see your hand anyway, because there might be something. Uh nope, nothing more valuable there. I will I will happily take that Buster Blader. And you'll have that nice uh jog in the spiritualist to help you out. I Obviously, guess. you're going to stick away from special summoning stuff. Yeah. Well, I will tribute the Earl of Demise and Goblin Zombie. By the way, we have Goblin Zombie errated now, so I'm not searching a zombie when it's destroyed. Summon Buster Blader! <sighs> no, he used my monster against me. Which is just enough tactic over Summon Skull, assuming there's not another battle trap. Mm. I really hope not. I run into Mirror Force Regulation Type and Magic Cylinder. I'd really like this play to work. Myself destroyed. <sighs> Dropping you to 4,000. I take my trap card. Soul rope. Soul rope. Soap on a rope. So now, the original copy says destroyed, sent to the graveyard. The newer copy specified destroyed by a battle 
We rather it so it doesn't have to be about battle, guys. So we use the oh. enemy effect, which is the original friendly. The life points are getting close. Every play we make matches the others like play basically. Like I don't think either of us has really kept a strong monster on the field for more than a turn. <laughs> or really kept a monster on the field for more than a turn. The card I choose now could decide the fate of the duel. I choose Electromagnetic Turtle. Come right. forth! I just literally can't do anything else, but I'm so happy I still have my Dark Sanctuary on the field. Your only out to it is D Spell, which I'm really hoping you don't draw. I hope you get Car of Sanctity. Please play Car of Sanctity. I would appreciate that. Look at that Buster Blader. The young Buster Blader. I wonder what that card is. Setting monster, is that it? It's your turn. I draw. Buster Blader, attack face down. Oh, I knew that was Jogan. Doesn't really matter which one I attack. I mean, Jogan has more attack and a dangerous effect, so. Uh, I will end my turn at that then. Another monster, and I end my turn. Another draw. Buster Blader, attack face down. No. Set Monst a monster and end my turn. Monster shattering effect. Now for the first time in a while, one of us has kept a strong monster on the field. And it's not even my own. I'll attribute my turtle to summon Dark Magician Girl. Magic formula? And boost her with magic formula. jeez. Oh, You're gonna attack the Dark Sanctuary? Okay, let's go. <laughs> you should probably just sit on it. Oh, I intend to. Draw. Well, I guess we're at a crossroads here. I will end my turn. Your end starts here. Oh, jeez. I activate the magic of Dispel. Oh, my God. He drew it, guys. Destroying Dark Sanctuary. The King of Games is drawing it. Now, Dark Magician needs. Girl. Return Buster Blader to me at once. Destroy it now. I take a hundred. I'm slowly chipping away those life points. You, you are. I'm slowly chipping away yours, sort of, too. Where about you? My turn? Yep. Draw. That is not really what I wanted. But, uh... Okay. I activate the dark door. Set a monster and end my turn. Both players can only attack with one monster in their respective battle phases. At this point, I'm just hoping to draw a Dark Sanctuary or Destiny board again. Attack middle. Sure. I end. I draw. And I had no more spells. I end. Yeah, I just need Dark Sanctuary. Attack middle. Or Destiny board. My turn? Yep. This works too. I'll banish three of my fiends to summon Dark Necrophia. A little bit of an aggressive play. But if I get rid of, if I get control of Dark Magician Girl here, this would be huge. Dark Necrophere attack. I use the effect of Electromagnetic Turtle. Oh geez, that's right. I forgot about that. By banishing him, it ends the battle phase immediately. All right, that is fine. That's better than the worst thing that I could have thought of. I end my turn. Whew, guys, what a close game. Obviously we had to put some duplicates in Bakora's deck because he doesn't have 40 unique cards. Just in case you're like, wow, there's two Dark Necrophiers and he's talking about a second Destiny board. Your Jaugen is gone too. My Jaugen, that was your Jaugen. You actually had to push through two Dark Necrophiers already because I premature burialed one. 
I know what you're thinking. Dang, I have no good options. I end. I draw. Let's go. Dark Necrophir, attack Dark Magician Girl. Mm hmm. I take 500, it's destroyed, equips. I take control of Dark Magician Girl. And, uh,. That'll do it for me. Dropping to 900, but I have a monster that can wipe out almost all of your life points in one go. Activate change of heart. Wow. Alright. You get Dark Magician Girl back for the turn. Tribute. Attack that one. This one? Yep. Sure. Earthbound Spirit. Them tribute? I feel like a tribute's gotta be coming in here. I end my turn. Wow. Alright, let's see what happens. Draw. Dark Magician Girl, attack him directly. I activate Kuribo's effect. Oh man. Wild. I set a monster and end my turn. I'm like I'm like most of the way through my deck, guys. This is a wild duel. All right. I'm sad to do this, but I must. I have to be Soul Taker. Oh, jeez. Destroy Dark Magician Girl. Give we both gave each <laughs> thousand. Wow. That's wild. I'll do mine first just because I'm greedy. I really want those thousand life points. I need more than you do. Next, also the card. Now, I have a card to activate. Exchange. Sure. Oh, jeez. Um, I'll grab Defusion. Wow, guys, I guess we're both playing with pretty bad hands. But if you take my spirit message, I wouldn't have been able to use Destiny Board. But Ectoplasma can steal you the game straight up. Alright, is it my turn? Yep. Draw. And I activate Life Force Sword. Uh, you just roll die. One, two, three, four, five, six. We're rolling a die because this is in a different sleeve, so Blue would be able to see if he picks randomly. All right, three, four, middle card. What did I lose? Hmm, was that the card I actually wanted to play this turn? I actually can't quite remember. I guess I'll just end my turn. Man, what a wild game. My turn? I end. Draw. Put that down to uh, three turns. You know what? It's it's a chance, but I'm just going to go for it. Gross Ghost. Attack for 1300. Yeah. I didn't want to, but... But... Um... I end. I have to make time seal. Oh, sure. And end. Uh-oh. I'll set one card. I don't even wonder what that is. And attack for 1,300. <laughs> Poking with that gross ghost of flood dreams. This is down to two turns, by the way. And I'll end. I mean, at this point, most of us have... Both of us have lost most of our big monsters. I'll summon Beta, a magnet warrior. Sure. The attack is gross ghost. Sure, and I drop by 400 to almost equal life points. Guys, this is down to the wire. They'll end my turn. Draw. And this one. I just want to get my card back. I'll end my turn. Let's see what happens, guys. I, I feel like this is going to be an anticlimactic finish no matter what, guys. But at this point, hopefully you've already uh, already gotten your, your, your bang for your buck. Attack face down. You take 100. My turn? Yep. Draw. I get my card back. Never plays it. Alright, YOLO. It's time to see if one of us can win this duel. I tribute the gross ghost of fled dreams to a dark ruler Hades. That's right, baby. Attack is beta.
you take 750. This could very well be the conclusion of the duel. Oops. Whoops. Technology. Sometimes, just, you know, might be user error, but sometimes it's hard to click. Anyway, I end my turn. 550. Let's see what, what comes of Yugi. Did he draw a monster? Mm -hmm. Slash brain control. <laughs> my turn. Oh, you can even activate brain control now. All right, let's have Dog Rule Hadez attack. Then I will set one card to each zone and end my turn. Bakor is mounting the pressure, finally. My turn? I'm running out of deck, too. Oh, yeah, my turn. I draw and activate my second Dark Sanctuary. Dark Rule Hadez attack. You will have facial gardener. Oh jeez, I take 150. And I switch into attack mode. Not like that matters, you can just switch it right back. Yep. Um, I end my turn. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, 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 what a point. And my Dark Door protects your uh, Bixel Garner from this drawback. Well guys, this isn't as epic as an anime game. I don't know what is. I end. Before you end, I activate Destiny board. Whoops. Hold up. Okay. And I'll place I in the monster zone. As a fiend, level one, zero attack. Okay. And draw for my turn. Um. Can't do anything, so I guess I'll pass. Look at this, guys. This is the dream. The dark sanctuary, dark door, destiny board combo. And Yugi doesn't have D-Spell or Dust Tornado. But I do have this card. I've clogged up my zones, though. If I don't play anything else, I have enough for Destiny Board. I know, it's like, kind of, um... Sadly though, Destiny Board is going to help get me closer to decking out. Well, I'm going to help you with that. Oh, for the love of God. Card of Sanctity. I guess I'm drawing three. I still have four cards left. Whew, I'm good. I'm good. No decking out here. By the way, we've car things you're added, if that's not obvious from the fact I mean <laughs> blue both drew and blue's field is still there. I end. Alright, let's put N, which I fortunately drew. Instead of having to pull yet another card from my deck down. And I draw. Um I I I think I'm I'm just good to end. Just just end. Uh, you have two more turns if you can't get Destiny Board off the field. Draw your last pathetic card. My grandfather's like has no pathetic cards. Wait, yeah, I kind of did. <laughs> it did have a lot. Ah, this card that only helps in the one specific situation that they wrote it in for this episode. You end. I place down A. Which I'm going to do like this, just so they look nice. I'm pretty sure we're about to see our first win via Destiny Board right There now. might be one on the channel already, actually. Um, I am my turn. Isn't this beautiful, guys? What a good showing for Bakora's deck. Two Dark Ruler Deses, two Dark Necrofears, two Dark Sanctuaries, two Destiny Boards in. And uh, it's the Reckoning. Good thing I don't have any spell and trap removal, otherwise double spell would be a concern. I can't do anything. Then it looks like I'll win when you end. I end. And I put down L. Well, guys, what a game. Really back and forth. Lots of cool plays. Cool answers to my plays for sure, like nifty D spells. But uh, when you when you don't draw answers, that sort of just happens. 
sad for uh, Yugi. I, but guys, yeah, uh, yeah, I, you can't activate. Yeah, I had the... Uh, I was at that fight point. Guys, look at that though. What a, what a game. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out the Bacora deck profile. Awesome, awesome. We'll probably do another Bacora duel, so look for that to come soon. And uh, YG Anime Games, out.